Objectives. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to 1. Identify the common ailments of the human reproductive system. 2. Explain the importance of taking care of one's reproductive system. Hi there, we are showing pictures. Say yes, if you are doing it. And say no, if not. Exercising regularly? Taking bath every day and washing your genitals with soap and water? Eating healthy meals with more fruits and vegetables? Using clean underwear every day? Sleeping for at least 8 hours a day? Drinking plenty of water? Very good, you answered yes, to all of them. It means you're taking good care of your reproductive system. What might happen if you are not taking care of your reproductive system? That's correct. If you are not taking care of your reproductive system, then some ailments or diseases may develop in your body. To help you understand these ailments or diseases, let us review the parts and functions of the male and female reproductive system. The female reproductive system comprises the ovaries, fallopian tube uterus, cervix and vagina. They work together as a body system to produce mature egg cells, to protect and nourish a fertilized egg until it fully develops into a baby, and to facilitate birthing. The male reproductive system comprises the testes, epididymis, scrotum, vas deferens, seminal vesicles, prostate gland, urethra, and penis. They work together as a body system to produce mature sperm cells, and to prepare and release them for possible fertilization in the female reproductive system. Now, let us go over some ailments of the human reproductive system. Dysmenorrhea or menstrual cramps refer to severe painful cramps at the lower abdomen before or during menstruation. The pain results from muscular movements in the uterus, which have many possible causes. Vulva vaginitis or vaginitis is the swelling or inflammation of the vulva, outer opening connected to the vagina, and vagina. Microbe imbalance and infection often cause vaginitis. Microbes in the vagina help protect the reproductive system. Infections often happen when unhealthy microbes grow more than the healthy microbes. Poor hygiene, using tight underwear, and allergic reactions to body soaps, lotion, or underwear cloth can cause vaginitis. Balanitis is the swelling or inflammation of the gland's penis, head of the penis, which can be itchy or painful. Poor hygiene, microbe infection, and allergic reactions to medicine, underwear cloth, or soap can cause balanitis. Prostatitis is the inflammation of the prostate or areas surrounding the prostate, which may or may not be painful. One cause is microbe infection, especially of microbes from the urethra. Reproductive cancer is a condition in which an uncontrolled growth of cells, malignant tumor, develops in an organ of the reproductive system. For females, it can be cervical, ovarian, uterine, vaginal, or vulvar cancer. For males, it can be testicular or prostate cancer. The cause of cancer is still being studied but may be associated with conditions inherited in the family or environmental and lifestyle factors. Cancer cells affect the normal healthy function of organs. They take up space and nutrients and do not perform normal tasks. Sexually transmitted diseases or infections, STD or STI, are infectious diseases that spread through intimate close contact. Some STDs include chlamydia, genital warts, and human immunodeficiency virus, HIV, infection. HIV infection is one of the life-threatening STDs, especially when it becomes acquired immunodeficiency syndrome, AIDS. HIV attacks and weakens the body's protection system called immune system. 
simple, treatable infections can become deadly for a person with a weak immune system. Infertility refers to the inability of the male and female to produce a fertilized egg and achieve pregnancy. It has a variety of causes, such as other ailments or conditions affecting the reproductive organs. Practicing healthy habits and lifestyles keeps you away from ailments of the reproductive system. Itchiness, unusual discharge, and having bad smell on the genital area can be signs of unhealthy or unhygienic lifestyle. See a doctor or physician if these experiences did not go away or became worse even after practicing healthy and hygienic habits. Gynecologists help females with their reproductive problems, while urologists help males with their reproductive problems. You and your family members may need to visit these doctors when experiencing continuing itchiness, unusual discharge, bad smell in the genital area, lower abdomen or genital pain, blood in urine, genital swelling, bumps, or growths, testicular lumps, male, painful, irregular, too little or too much blood during menstruation, female, possible infertility. Gynecologists and urologists can also give you additional advice to prevent getting related ailments. Practice exercise. Answer the following questions. Question 1. What are some ailments of the female reproductive system? Answer. Dysmenorrhea or menstrual cramps vulvovaginitis. Question 2. What are some ailments of the male reproductive system? Answer. Prostatitis balanitis. Question 3. What are some ailments for both reproductive systems? Answer. Reproductive cancer sexually transmitted diseases infertility. Question 4. Which phrases refer to ways of taking care of your reproductive system? Answer. Use clean and comfortable underwear every day take a daily bath. Question 5. Which doctors should you visit for problems in the reproductive system? Answer. Gynecologist, for females, urologist, for males. Lesson recap. How do you take care of your reproductive system? That's correct. You take care of your reproductive system when you 1. Eat healthy food 2. Drink plenty of water 3. Have enough sleep 4. Exercise regularly 5. Avoid unhealthy habits like smoking 6. Take a daily bath with soap and water 7. Use clean and comfortable underwear every day why is it important to take care of your reproductive system? That's correct. Taking care of your reproductive system helps keep you away from ailments so that your organs can perform their tasks. What are some ailments of the human reproductive system? That's correct. Dysmenorrhea and vulvovaginitis for females, balanitis and prostatitis for males, and reproductive cancer, sexually transmitted diseases, and infertility for both males and females. Who can help people with problems in the human reproductive system? That's correct. Gynecologists can help in female reproductive problems, and urologists can help in male reproductive problems. 